Hello dear subscribers, today I will tell you how I can fix this error, here you can see it, uh, so it's Windows error 0x800 705b4, so how you can fix it, first you need to try, you need to go to services, so just go here to search tab and just write here services, so here you will see services, just click on it, So in services you need to find background intelligent, here you can see it, so just go to properties. And in properties you choose, in my, not manual but automatic, and you choose start. So after you do it, just click apply and OK. So after you do it, you need to scroll down to Windows Update. So here you will find Windows Update, so just right click on it and choose Properties. And here must be Automatic and uh, Service Status must be running, so if not just click Start and click Apply and OK. So if it doesn't help you, you can also try to go to your Search tab and just right here Troubleshoot. Here you can see Troubleshooter. Uh, trouble. Uh, troubleshoot Settings, just click on it. Uh, just uh, wait after it will load, uh, go to troubleshoot to Windows update and here click on run the troubleshooter. It means that it will automatically detect all the problems and fix corrupting files, missing files, errors and just uh, here show you list of errors. After you see this list you need to restart your computer and it will automatically fix it. So I hope that it, this method, method will help you. If not, Another thing you can also check is open your file manager, my computer, and just go to your system disk, uh, go to Windows, and in Windows you need to find software distribution, so just scroll down, software distribution, here you can see it, you need to choose all the files here, and just delete all of them. So some files are using, that's why you can't delete them. So just skip them. So after you do it, you can also try the last method if it doesn't help you to. Uh, just go to uh, search tab and just write CMD and uh, open your command prompt and just write uh, CFC, write slash and scan now and just click enter uh, so you see i must be admin uh, run this app like administrator to have rights write uh, some comments so just click again cmd and just right click on this program and choose run as administrator yes so now we just need to write svc scan now and just click enter so just wait after it will check all the files for corrupting and update your files and just uh, wait after it will finish and restart your computer and I hope that this last method will help you. So thanks for watching, have a nice day, subscribe to my channel, click like and goodbye.